Hi YouTube, welcome to Origin. I think it's been about probably two hours since the first time this was uploaded that I've just come back from the camp, which I was absolutely convinced would be... like if, if there is an afterlife it would be encapsulated entirely in that campsite as hell, but that wasn't the case, it was actually really good. Surprisingly good for a campsite. Well, when I say really good, I mean for camp standards. It was it was really okay as an event, but that's all I could really expect. So it was cool. It was fine. But that's not what you're interested in, is it? You want to see me talk about some random, meaningless something or other. So okay, I saw this. I saw your comments on my video, Machina. Um, Sophia, yes, um, you asked me to tie my hair back in a ponytail. Unfortunately, I'm too incompetent to do that. I tried once at my great aunt's funeral and it was a disaster. It was just all over the place, so I'm not going to do that, I'm sorry to say. But I've done this instead. So tell me what you think. It's. Here, yeah, I. I don't know what I was just thinking, but as I've already said, you know, that's exactly me, so this is what you can come to expect from me in the future. Not not exactly this look, but tons of variations and stuff. Yeah. What I want to talk to you about is uh, labels, something I carried forward from the Machina video. Oh yeah, this this isn't in the same format either, it's all done. There's no script, as you can tell by my stuttering and gaps and stuff, so. I just want to say, um, I told this user Pixie Eve that uh, I don't like labels. He, I think he deduced it from the video from, by what he said in reply to either Sophia or me, but I couldn't tell. But just to clarify a couple of things, I, I don't like labels, but I'll use them if they're convenient. Because the alternative is, like, say, like if I wanted to say something like uh, I am a liberal I would just say the alternative would be I believe in freedom of speech, freedom of thought and freedom in general just freedom, viva la freedom you know that's you see what I mean, it's just it's kind of George Carlin logic, you know, simplify things instead of you, you, instead of you know, using all this tons of words you just simplify it well, okay, it's, it's, prob it's probably a bad example. I'm not going to edit this, I'm just going to let it run through, see how this comes out. But, he, he was talking about euphemisms in one, one of his um, speeches. And, so instead of saying, those passengers in need of special assistance, he said, cripples, one word. That, so that, that's the kind of logic I'm applying to this, I'm just simplifying things. That's why I use labels, because it's just easier. I'm into easy. I don't want any of this complicated rubbish. I don't want it. So, yeah. That's my position on labels. Uh, I actually had a couple of similar videos about this, but I think it's pre-live action, so a couple of my Sims videos, like the opinion run, uh, I think maybe the protruding line as well. So. Oh, that, that's one other thing I want to ask. Uh, if you like The Sims videos, like, or if you want to try and watch them, you know, let me know. Let me know if this format's, you know, better than The Sims format. And I'll see what I can do about all that stuff, so. Yeah. I really suck at these, you know, continuous videos, so I'm just going to make this really simple. And say what I said before, but keep it simple. I want to... I want to ask you guys to watch a couple of The Sims videos, or even just small snippets of it, and tell me whether you can actually stand watching them. Because I'm considering shooting the Sims videos I've already done in live action, and just retroactively deleting them after I've completed each one. So... That would be my question to you, should I do that? 
or do you like the Sims videos as they are, should, and should I just move on? So yeah, that, that's all I'm going to say. Uh, I'm back! <laughs> like I was gone in the first place, what, what am I? Some kind of idiot?